chromatics. This is the classic chromatic exercise where we're just playing four pick strokes and then doing the string cross and moving in this way across six strings. First up, starting on a down stroke, we've got downward pick slanted ascending. Let's look at that slowed down. Notice how the pick strokes are generated by wrist yaw, aka side to side wrist motion. And because we're doing inside alternate pick string crosses, you might just be able to see me doing tiny upward wrist pitching motions for the very last pick stroke of each string. This is to make sure that my pick aims at the new string I intend to cross to. Now for downward pick slanted descending, so coming back the other way. Now for the slow motion. Because coming back the other way forces our string crosses to become outside string crosses, the wrist pitching micro maneuver here is slightly different. This time we're pitching down at the wrist once we've passed our destination string that we intend to cross to. See if you can spot it. Now let's start on an upstroke for upward pick slanted ascending. Let's view that in slow motion. As always, the pick strokes are generated by wrist yaw, aka side to side wrist motion. The string crosses we're doing here are outside string crosses, so again, keep an eye out for that slight downward wrist pitching motion once I've arrived at the new string that I intend to cross to. Now, to come back the other way, upward pick slanted descending chromatics. Let's slow that down. All these string crosses are inside picks, meaning that there's a slight upward wrist pitch motion happening as I leave each string. <laughs> 